yet again, Will Smith continues to publicly embarrass himself. Let's get into this. Hey guys, as most of you have already heard by now, Will Smith smacked Chris Rock in an attempt to redeem what's left of his already decimated manhood. Just in case, I will roll the clip for those of you who may have not seen the clip yet. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> <laughs> it's, that, was a, that was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh oh, Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked out of me. You put my name out your fing mouth. Wow, dude. Yes. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. I'm going to, okay? <laughs> I can, oh, okay. As you guys just saw in the clip, Chris Rock makes a joke about Will Smith's wife, Jada's balding hair. Will Smith was initially seen laughing, but Jada was clearly bothered by the joke. Will Smith saw her reaction and decided to go on stage and smack Chris Rock in an attempt to assert his dominance. Then he continues to berate Chris, making the already awkward situation much worse. Now here's the issue that I have with the situation. I really don't care that Will Smith thought it was a good idea to assault Chris in front of the whole world. I understand some men take the protection and respect of their family very seriously. That's why I always advocate for avoiding jokes about another man's family as they can result in immediate violence as you just saw in the clip. No. My real issue stems from the disingenuous nature of Will Smith. Let me explain. Will Smith is not the kind of guy to just go randomly smacking dudes for making an obvious joke at an award show where roasting is expected to take place. These guys have gone to enough award shows to realize what a joke is. For God's sake, they hang out with and work with comedians on the regular. They know very well what a lighthearted joke is. Even Will, as you just saw in the clip, was initially laughing at the joke. In my opinion, what Will Smith saw was an opportunity to change the narrative about how masculine he really is. As many of you know, for the past few years, Will's relationships and family life have been on blast, mainly due to the family's own policy about being open regarding most issues they have. They put their dirty laundry on Front Street for the world to see. Jada specifically does this on her own show and when she guest stars on another person's show. This is very well documented. She even openly admitted to sleeping with other men and her numerous issues that she has with Will Smith. Because of all these revelations, Will has been the subject of ridicule for quite some time now. Let's be real, Will is not about that life. Just look at what he said after the altercation with Chris. Let's roll the clip. I am overwhelmed by what God is calling on me to do and be in this world. Oh, wow! Wow! I want to be a vessel for love. Oh, wow! Wow! I'm being called on in my life to love people. Oh, wow. You see this goofy nonsense? He wants to be a quote, vessel for love yet he just slapped a man a minute ago. And then he proceeds to cry. This is not a man who establishes order and protects his family. This is a broken, over-emotional man who has so little respect for his own family that he allows his wife to go around airing personal issues to the public while she openly admits to cheating on her husband. Even her ex-lovers have so little respect for Will and his family that they publicly come out and speak about the affairs that they had with Will's wife. 
ask yourself, is that a man who really seeks to establish order? Or is this a confused, over emotional and broken man? Guys, that's my take on the situation. I could be wrong. Hey, this whole thing could be fake. Who knows? Let me know what you think about this story down in the comment section below. I really want to hear your take and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.